got it all made. I'm outside on the balcony. Taste test. What's up family, it's Naj with Built by Plants. And I have a fun, low calorie recipe for y'all today, all right? So this is gonna satisfy your sweet tooth cravings and the best part, you can have it whenever you want throughout the day. Breakfast, lunch, snacks, even snacks, <laughs> whenever you wanna have it, all right? So this is strawberry shortcake protein ice cream. And the reason why, so you can have it when you want because it's a lot healthier than regular ice cream. Low calories, 365 total calories with 28 grams of protein. The overall goal really is to make this a high volume recipe, meaning you can eat a lot of it. It takes up a lot of space in your stomach for a few calories, right? For minimal calories. I'm gonna go ahead and show you the ingredients and show you the ones that's optional, the ones that are required. And before we do that, go ahead and like this video, comment below if you do try it, and then uh, share this with somebody else that may need this, all right? We need to get these recipes out to the masses, these plant-based, delicious recipes so you can show other people that you can still enjoy the food that you want without all the animal products and without all the calories. All right, let's get right into it. We need some frozen strawberries. If you don't want to buy them frozen, you can buy them fresh and freeze them yourself. And we're going to be using 140 grams of the frozen strawberries. We need frozen bananas. Now, I usually chop my own fresh bananas up and freeze them, but I wanted to knock this recipe out for you all. And I didn't want to have to wait for them to freeze, so I grabbed this. Um, and we're gonna be using 70 grams of this, which is just uh, 40 calories, right? For the actual protein, we're gonna be using Orgain Vanilla Protein Powder. Um, so two scoops of this is 46 grams, which is 150 calories and 21 grams of protein. I'm gonna be using a little bit of PB2, the powdered peanut butter, and it is amazing. It saves you a lot of calories. You still get that peanut butter taste, and it's pretty decent with the protein. Look at that. 60 calories give you six grams of protein, which is pretty nice. I'm right? gonna be using about 10 grams of this. It's gonna help with the thickness. So this is the tapioca flour, and we're gonna be using roughly about 10 grams of this. We have the war gram, all right? So this is a thickening agent. Basically, just makes the food expand which gives you a little bit more to actually eat, right? Now I'm gonna be using about three grams of this, which is 15 calories. It is not required. You do not need this. So if you don't want it, you don't have to use it. I grabbed this from Whole Foods. If you wanna know where to pick it up from, gluten-free, not that that matters to me, but you know, just in case you like gluten-free stuff. We're gonna be using a little bit of salt because it's gonna bring out some of the flavors, just like a pinch, not a lot, all right? Another optional, but this is stevia. We're gonna be using two packs of that just for a little bit more sweeter taste. Then we're gonna be using some water. We could use almond milk, but I wanna save that 30 calories. And I'm just gonna use water and then we're gonna use some ice as well. Now for the water, we're gonna be using about 125 grams. And then for the ice, we're gonna be using about 200 grams of ice. And we have a food processor, which is how we're gonna make all of this, all right? So you can see the food processor here. I literally picked this up from Walmart for 30 bucks, all right? It was like $29. You can also order it from Amazon, but if you wanna make this today, go ahead and go to Walmart, grab one of these. And this is what we're gonna to use to make the actual uh, strawberry shortcake ice cream. I'm gonna go ahead and start weighing out my ingredients. So I'm gonna turn this food scale on, back that thing up. All right, here we go. It's a little flour and stuff on there, so just ignore that. I put the bowl in there first, turn the full scale on, make sure it's on zero. 140 grams of strawberries, give or take, because it may not be exactly 140, get as close as possible, and that's 138, so that's cool. Now I'm going to make sure the scale is reset again, add in 70 grams of the bananas. Turn that back on. I really need a new scale. I've been having this one for about, you know, four years maybe now. Um, this did its job, but it's about time to retire it. All right, 70 grams, perfect. Throw these back in the freezer, the PB2, weigh this out, and we're gonna be using 10 grams. There we go, 10 grams PB2. I hope y'all can see that. Take the little pinch of salt, like I said, just like that, sprinkle that in. And the tapioca, turn this back on, <laughs> exactly. 11 or 10 grams of protein powder. I'm gonna go ahead and pour that in there as well. Now it was just two scoops of protein powder, 
But if you want to be even more specific to get the calories on point, it's, it's more accurate to use the 46 grams. Um, because two scoops can be anything depending on how you actually scoop it out. Some people say this is two scoops, right? That's a that's a heaping two scoop, scoops. But if you knock it down, this is really what two scoops is. So we're going to add that there and that there. All right, there we go. But you don't have to do all that. You can just do two scoops if you want. Um, I just like the precision. All right, so now we got all our powders in there. Bring this over here. I'm gonna back that thing up. There we go. Pour that right on on top. I'm going to take the bowl with all the powders and I'm just gonna dump that right on up in there. Going to weigh out my ice. Here we go. We got 202. So I'm gonna pour that in now. Just like that. And you know what? I'm gonna take a little bit of ice out. Let me see. All right, so we're gonna do 150, 150 grams of ice. And then we're gonna get our water and we are good to go. Okay, that's a little bit more than 125, but we just won't use it all then. I'm gonna pour some in there now. So we can start the process. And then we're gonna turn this on. But before I do that, I'm going to grab a spoon so I can be stirring it up, all right? It's not gonna be a perfect blend. This is not a blender. This is a food processor. So I'm gonna be spinning it, I'm gonna take the top off, mix it in, and you'll see how this whole thing is gonna to turn to this ice cream-like texture. And here we go. All right. And uh, we're gonna do a little bit of stirring. Now, to be honest, I really like when it's this type of texture. I've tasted it before when it's like this and it really tastes like strawberry shortcake, but we're gonna keep stirring, all right? Actually, let's try that, so I'm gonna taste it. With the protein powder, the strawberry chunks, and everything else, literally it tastes like a strawberry shortcake. As I blend it more into the ice cream-like texture, it becomes less of the strawberry shortcake taste, so, you know, you can play around with that as far as the consistency that you want, but we're gonna add a little bit more water, and get some more of the big pieces down at the bottom so we can continue our blend for this ice cream. Mm. Push it all down again. Make sure that all of it's getting there, but you can start to see the ice cream like texture coming about. Yeah. All right, look at this. It's coming along pretty nicely. Now there will probably be some ice cube chunks in there still. You can get those blended by continuing to push those down. I tend to not to mind ice cube chunks because I kind of like ice cubes now for whatever reason. It's not ready yet, honestly, but I kind of like it when it's not fully ready. It tastes really good to me. Oh, that's good. Hey, I'm pretty satisfied with that consistency. Scoop it on out. Oh, quick side note. You can make this a lot more by just continuing to add more water and more ice, right? Just continue to expand because of the war gum, right? Or is it gore gum, whatever it's called. If they continue to expand, it continues to get thicker, but you probably will also sacrifice a little bit of flavor. So I kind of like it how it is right now. I think this is a good consistency. There's still some ice cubes in there, but like I said, it's fine if you want to get rid of those ice cubes, continue to blend and it will just all blend in and become thicker. I don't really mind, so I'm gonna go ahead and start pouring this into the bowl. Quick thickness check. Let's go ahead and 
Yep, see that? It's not coming out. That's thick. That's ice cream right there. Mm-hmm. It's not a magic trick, or is it? Pop this on out, and I'm gonna scoop this. And so what you can do if you want this to be um, more hard or more solid, is just freeze it, right? When you pour it in a bowl or whatever, you can just freeze this whole bowl. Just add some, what's the word for this stuff? Just put some wrap on it, freeze it for a little bit, you know, maybe 30 minutes, 45 an hour, and then go ahead and have it. That way it'd be more ice cream like texture. I tend to like this texture right here. All right, family, so this is our strawberry shortcake protein ice cream, 100% plant-based, 100% vegan. And this is our little vegetable garden out here on the balcony. Um, but yeah, so basically 365 calories, 28 grams of protein, and it tastes amazing. This is like cheating, to be honest. This is a diet hack, a cheat code. They're gonna make a new recipe book called Plant-Based Cheat Codes. I like that. So uh, yeah, 365 calories, 28 grams of protein. And again, you can make it different ways. Uh, so if you want access to this recipe, go ahead and click the link down below. Join the Pocket Coach, and we have a full a virtual kitchen with monthly recipes that we add every single month. Pretty much sometimes like every week, honestly. Um, you get access to this recipe plus every other recipe that we've ever created and we'll continue to create because we add new ones consistently. Get access to the Pocket Coach right now. It's still only $15 a month. That price will be going up because we're getting close to the 150 member mark. So once we hit that mark, we will be increasing the pricing. So get in and stay locked in at the $15 price point while you can, all right? See y'all later. Hope y'all enjoy the rest of your day. Talk to you soon. And if you need coaching, there's a link down below for that as well. Schedule a free body strategy call and we'll help you put together a plan that can help you reach your body goals on a plant-based diet, regardless if that's losing weight, gaining some size, building muscle, or just incorporating this style of eating so that you can enjoy it and stay healthy for the rest of your life. All right. Talk to y'all soon. Peace.